um, as the state leader for Keep America Beautiful, Keep Arkansas Beautiful works to inspire and educate individuals to reduce litter, recycle, and keep Arkansas beautiful. And it seems that you have a lot of inspired individuals here in Harrison. It takes vision, commitment, hard work, imagination, and good leadership to create a good community. Thank you, Sarah, and thank you, Harrison. I'll tell you, it may be kind of cloudy outside, but in our eyes, you shine today. <laughs> Mayor Crockett and city uh, leaders, community volunteers especially, on behalf of Keep Arkansas Beautiful Commission, it is my pleasure to be with you this morning and to offer you the sincere appreciation of a grateful state. We recognize the inspired environmental concern that you have demonstrated and the impressive improvements that your community is undertaking. It enhances Harrison's clean and green quality of life. I'm very happy to recognize your delightful community as a winner of the Arkansas Shine Award. This award distinguishes, distinguishes Harrison as one of only six communities statewide to be so honored and recognized. It is a shining example of an Arkansas community's commitment to environmental quality of life and economic advancement. The Shine Award identifies Harrison as a community that understands and embraces the realization that it takes bold vision and leadership to achieve dramatic improvement. And through investing in its environmental sense, it is implementing the means to produce economic dollars, real benefits that will be returned throughout the community. Mayor Crockett, again, let me say, uh, I'm drawn to this to be with you today and to acknowledge your outstanding <laughs> environmental concern and to recognize the impressive improvements <coughs> that it is enabling, and to express our sincere appreciation to you for it. Keep Arkansas Beautiful Commission is proud today to recognize the city of Harrison as a 2011 Arkansas Shine community. It's one of only six in the state and the only one of its population size. We're happy to celebrate your award-winning work and to salute you, if you will, sir, please accept this as a token of our symbol of gratitude for all that you, Harrison, and your, your wonderful community do to help us make and keep Arkansas beautiful. to uh, uh, watch us receive this award. It's a very prestigious award for Harrison, Arkansas. Um, we have been working hard since I took office in January and some of us long before that um, to improve our environmental uh, stance and try to uh, clean up uh, Harrison. Uh, initially when I went into office uh, we made an effort to uh, um, be better uh, at keeping our city streets clean. One of our aldermen, Dave Fitton, came up with the idea from Fayetteville that he brought from there of the cigarette butt containers on the square. We got those out and about early on and we have noticed a tremendous decrease in the amount of litter on the streets from cigarette butts. Um, we have been a, uh, in the process right now, currently, of redesigning our uh, uh, trash uh, service here in town which will be going out for bid um, and the contract's up next year and in that bid process we will uh, strive to uh, make recycling a lot easier for people to do. Uh, our intention is to, uh, in the bid specs, put uh, a 95 gallon recycling container in every person's house to uh, promote recycling. Um, we, uh, our parks are in the process of uh, uh, getting cleaned up and have been. Our recycling at the city level has been um, uh, much more focused than it has been in the past. Uh, we have uh, made an effort to, to clean our town up. We see people come into town uh, that stop in the office uh, quite often, uh, mentioning how they like Harrison, want to know what the opportunities are here, if there are any opportunities for small business. 
Uh, they, they enjoy being here. They like our square. They like seeing what's been accomplished around our square. We realize that uh, corporate America, when they're relocating, look around town, look to see what kind of uh, town you have, whether it's clean, whether your square is vibrant, um, and what else is going around town. We don't need to lose anybody because uh, uh, they have a bad impression of, of us. So we have been uh, focusing on those things. I'd like to acknowledge uh, uh, several people in the room and, and that aren't with us that uh, don't know the meaning of the word can't. Um, Beth McIntyre, uh, headed up our skate park uh, fund drive. Most of that was uh, uh, funded with private donations and private grants. Um, did a great job. The kids enjoy that. They're down there all the time using that. Ken Bailey uh, um, has been with our trails committee for I don't know how many years, 20 plus probably Ken, but uh, um, we've been working on trails here in town for years, and, and we're working currently on getting a grant to extend those trails over to Woodland Heights. Um, our core members, uh, core has done a tremendous job uh, focusing the downtown area, along with HHBA. Uh, they have, uh, who has been tremendous at, at creating activities downtown and bringing people downtown and showing them what downtown Harrison is all about. Uh, we have, uh, uh, they've had a lot of focus and those people don't know the meaning of the word can't. They have uh, uh, gone above and beyond and, and uh, found ways to do things that people didn't think were possible. And I think that has brought our community together and uh, uh, people in the community that thought that these things would never happen in Harrison have been quite surprised. So, uh, I, I want to thank uh, everybody that came today and uh, uh, thanks to uh, you guys for the Arkansas Shine Award and we will probably display it. Thank you. Another shining example of a community that takes itself seriously when it comes to environmental appreciation and enhancement and when it comes to the realization that those sort of things increases your economic viability. And I'm glad to hear you reflect on that later. Uh, that really concludes our ceremony, except uh, we hope you'll join us for the refreshments. Again, it is our pleasure to be here. Uh, it is so inspiring for us to read through the applications for the Shine Award and, and to get excited, re-excited about what it is we do and because we, we take a little bit, just a teeny credit, because the only thing we can really accomplish is inspire volunteers. We can give them programs to work in, but essentially, Everyone that we work with is a volunteer. And when we see that communities are taking hold of that concept and the people are taking back their communities and the leadership encourages that, uh, we're just so excited. And that's what makes it such fun for us to come and recognize these communities as shine communities. So again, thank you for us.